Um, honestly though, I thought it would be taller. <laughs> this is a good deal. I got my honey, got my honey bun, <laughs> and I got the Golden Gate Bridge. And your kids. And these things. <laughs> A lot of men and women made sacrifices for us to even have the ability to do what we're doing today. The whole walk around this is pretty awesome. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've ever been on a road this steep. I feel like you're driving straight up. <laughs> you're gonna get punched. <laughs> We are at the San Francisco RV Resort, which is right outside the city in Pacifica, and it's the perfect launching point for us to go and check out San Francisco for the day. That's what we're doing next. We've been here like, what, three days we already? We have. We've gotten... And the weather has looked... Just like this. Just like this. <laughs> Usually we base our explorations on like a sunset or a sunrise, and there right. hasn't been any of those. Nothing. So we're gonna go get donuts for lunch right now because we were hoping that the fog would clear so we could go see the Golden Gate Bridge. It just, it just hasn't, and that's just what you get. That's I mean, right. you just gotta go for it. Uh, we've been working the past three days, that's why we really haven't ventured out too much, but. Uh, yeah, but today's the perfect day. Um, our weekends are usually in the middle of the week, so that, that works well for less people and less traffic and stuff, so. So over here, I don't know if you see the fence right there, that used to be RV sites, but the cliff, like the oceans, like reclaiming the cliff, so right. all that dropped off and they. And you can see where the cliff has just like dropped off into the ocean there's like pipes and like electrical wires and stuff that are just like gone hanging it's, out of the cliff it's, it's wild crazy so look at this this is like there's just been water coming off the ocean look at what it's doing everything is like rusting that's never happened before isn't that crazy um look at all this stuff just it's never rusted before never it's ever funny so it's definitely something to think about if you're out by the ocean you want to make sure I am that you definitely going to be rinsing this yeah, you can see the truck off. right now it's it's filthy just sitting here. And what do you think about this? This is a brand new camera, so it's the first time I've filmed with it. I know. I've had it for a couple hours, so. He's pretty excited. Hopefully it looks a little better. Uh, the <laughs> other one was three years old, so it was time for something new. It was time. So we're gonna get some donuts and head to Baker Beach, and that's supposed to have a really cool view of the Golden Gate, which we haven't even glimpsed yet, so we're excited to go check that out. I'm hoping the fog isn't rolled in so much that we can't see any of the bridge. You never know. It is what it is. Uh, What's the donut shop we're going to? Uncle Andy's or something? Uncle something. Uncle something. There was a really nice one right next to the park, but it's closed. It's closed today. It's one day we were going to go see it. It's, it's closed. something we've actually learned before is that normally we like doing things on Mondays and Tuesdays, and a lot of bakeries are closed on Mondays. Yeah, because they're busy days of the <laughs> weekend. They're busy days of the weekend, so yeah. Anyways, we're going to go find some donuts, and we've already got coffee and hot chocolate and all that fun stuff, and we're going to go see the Golden Gate Bridge finally. He couldn't even let us leave without rinsing the truck off. Of course, that's the bakery that's right down from us that's closed for the day. <laughs> your donuts looked really good, so stop by and visit if you're not here on a Monday. So what, it's Uncle Benny's we're going to, not Uncle Andy's? Correct, Uncle Benny's Donut and Bagel Shop. All right, and I just had to rinse it at least. I don't usually just rinse it, but that had just like this film of black stuff all dripping down. I don't know what kind of soot it came from, but... It had to be done. It rinsed off, so we're good-ish, we're good-ish. It's a bridge, but you just see it in so many movies and stuff. It's just, it's just one of those things that's really cool to see in person. It's so cool. And you guys know that we're movie buffs and we love watching movies in the places that we're going to visit. So we just finished watching all the Planet of the Apes. I know there's a lot more, but that's 
that's one of the movie series we like. The Planet of the Apes is cool, and that's well, kind of based here with the Golden San Gate Bridge. San Francisco, the bridge, the redwoods. There's a lot of pieces of what we're going to go see. Yeah. So it's neat. watched us before you know that we're not big on cities anyway so this is cool but this is cool get some donuts Layla Yeah. I had to do it. Apple fritter. I just. Well, I what's just in those ones? Them. We have raspberry and lemon. Two raspberries and one lemon. Oh. Mm. Yum, they look so good. Okay. Let's go to the beach. Oh, cool. Oh my gosh. That's awesome. Honestly though, I thought it would be taller. <laughs> <laughs> this is spectacular. Like, yeah. I, this is far surpassed what I thought this beach area was gonna look like. That is spectacular. Yeah, and the fact that you can you can park free here. You can park free, there's restrooms. I'm just really hungry, I wanna eat some donuts. <laughs> it's like noon, we haven't we even haven't eaten, eaten yet. anything yet. The landscape of San Francisco is so different than anything else we've ever seen before that like- so, Well, we avoid cities, so we maybe, do. maybe there's a ton of places, but I'm probably I'm sure, not. but there is a very special feel to the culture in San Francisco, even driving oh, yeah. through driving, the town. Driving down the steep roads and- So many different cultures here. It's such a melting pot of people. It's so fun. But I mean, like, look at what we have on the other side of the, the view here. Like the, oh. the multi- Oh, there's Layla. About Layla. <laughs> I'm talking about the multicolored houses. It's one of those places that you've seen a lot of scenes in movies and this just brings it to real life. It's, yeah. It's, it's so fun. That's what travel's all about. We love it. And look, there's blue sky peeking out. Yeah. yeah, maybe we're gonna get some blue sky. We haven't seen blue sky in days. Like a week. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time. So maybe we'll get the sun. And the fact that it's blue on the other side of the bridge is fantastic too. So um, there's an apple fritter calling my name. So I have to go. Let me see those donuts. Mm -hmm. This one's mine. It's <laughs> <That's> mine. <laughs> What was it? Uncle Andy? Uncle... Uncle Donnie? Benny. Uncle Benny. <laughs> You're never gonna remember this. Uncle Benny. Good job. Oh my god. This is a good donut. Ma'am. I really don't know how to judge fritters at this point. Yeah, let's stop. This is incredible. Really? Where's your filling? Did she get to it yet? Do you have any oh. filling? Not yet. Oh my gosh, are you getting gypped right now? Oh, okay, there it is. Okay. There we go. Yeah, look, the lemon one's open. That's a lot of filling. I was about to be mad at Uncle Uncle Andy. Benny. I was about to be mad at Uncle Benny. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I can't be mad with this apple fritter. Oh my gosh. Donuts, coffee, and a view with your family? I this mean... Is a good, this is a good deal. I got my honey, got my honey bun, <laughs> and I got the Golden Gate Bridge. And wow. your kids. And these things. It's a cool view, huh? It's raining. It's raining? Look over here. We're about to get wet. Mom and Layla are packing everything up for us. Oh, they are? I think where I wanted to be was at that beach right there to yeah. get a shot. 
I'll take it from here, I guess, before it gets rained on. Oh, they made it to us. That looks like a sunny spot on the beach over there. Oh, right above us. We're gonna get sun for one second. These are not my barnacle sandals. Okay, what's next on our list? Next is driving down Lombard Street. That's like the crazy windy road that Corey's always wanted to drive the truck down, so. We got the GoPro 360, so it might look cool. I know, it's gonna be sweet. We're actually leaving here tomorrow as well, so we get one more shot at good weather in the Golden Gate Bridge. It is supposed to be sunny tomorrow, but you never know with fog, it, you just never know. So that's the main, this is really, I don't know if I've mentioned, this is the main reason to come, to come here. I wanted to drive the RV across the Golden Gate Bridge. So tomorrow we're going to do that. And we're we, going to figure out if it's a good idea or not. I know it's a good <laughs> it's idea. A good I'm idea. Just joking. And we didn't know this until we got here, but we happen to be driving in the right direction across the Golden Gate Bridge because there's no tolls if you're going northbound out of San Francisco. So it's that's only if cool. you're coming back into the city heading south that there's a toll. So we're we're free. So it's I think it's $9. It's a little less than $9 yep. to drive across. Okay. Our RV would cost like $34. So a truck with with a two axle trailer has $34. But tomorrow is free. Tomorrow's free. I've really been liking all these like succulent flowers that are the whole coast of oh California gosh. so far. They're so gorgeous, especially on like the cliff's edges because they're like vines, they hang off the edge. These ones are hot pink. I mean, they're all short. They're like squishy feeling. They're not leaves, but yeah, they hang down over the cliff. It's so awesome. And there's fields of them. Fields, like, yeah. Right by that last uh, lighthouse. lighthouse even. They're just everywhere, fields of them. So cool. But this is travel. I mean, just, just the small things that you don't think about uh, being different are what I kind of nerd out about. <laughs> I love it. You're a geek, Kenny. The other amazing thing about travel is just remembering history. I mean, there's guns here pointed out at the ocean. Crazy. It's just crazy to think about that we were defending this coast and all of our coast. I don't know if we take that for granted right now, or I know I don't. I was in the military, so I know what goes into it, but there were dudes sitting here manning this gun at one point overlooking the Golden Gate Bridge. A lot of men and women made sacrifices to give us what we have today, for us to even have the ability to do what we're doing today. So thank you all who have served. So obviously there's these ones here, and then even closer, there's even more fortifications up by the Golden Gate Bridge. Fire it off, Layla. Well, if I didn't have to. Just pull on something. Pull on And go ch ch Gotta have the reflection with us. This is kind of a cool view. See the color of that water? I don't think so.
Oh, look at these fans, man. <laughs> look at the fans, guys. <laughs> the tunnel's just making you think you're going fast anyways. Yeah, the light's moving so quickly. Uh, going the right way, Let's right? Let's hope so. We are going to attempt to find Lombard Street. <laughs> going up. Yep, going up. Yes. Woo! Look at what this grade is. I don't know what the grade is. How do you, you always think about roads that you drive, what you grew up with, and all I can think about is like what this road would be like with snow and ice. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, I don't think they have. I don't to. think they have that trouble here. Goodness gracious, this is nuts. Wow. Just straight up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been on a road this steep. Yeah, no, I don't think it's so like, either. It's like you feel like you're driving straight up. All right, I think this is okay. I think over this rise. Is this it? Is we're coming to the top of Lombard Street. Oh, look at the Bay Bridge. Going, but I don't want to know. A predictable life is not what I want. Putting one foot down, one step at a time. Let the road turn that shit's fine. People ask all the questions, the box you win. To classify your life with the stroke of a pen. Take those old rules, crumple them, and throw one out. We're burning that box right now. Moon breakers, movers and shakers. Don't ever silence your voice Dream makers Risk takers Don't ever silence your voice Look at Alcatraz coming down this hill, that is so cool. That was, that was just a lot of fun. I mean, it's straight <laughs> down. You can see everybody's just, everybody watching is just having a good time. Everybody's happy. It's just, it's a cool spot. And this right here, Check out Alcatraz. Probably not a cool spot. Yeah. If you're a troublemaker. I guess the saying used to be that if you were bad, you went to prison, but if you were bad in prison, you went to Alcatraz. <laughs> One of the really sad things about San Francisco right now is that the cable cars are not running because of COVID. I did really kind of want to see them. I know, it's kind of a bummer. It is a bummer. And one other thing, really quick, this is a little PSA. Earlier our footage was probably shakier than crap. I don't know if I can fix it later, but this is a new camera I mentioned earlier. Right. This is the very first time using it. and. For some reason, the digital IS was turned off. All the IS was, image stabilization, yeah. all of it was turned off from the factory. I thought I messed around with it to get it to a good stage, but... Apparently, we missed it. Oh, I can't close you that can't do that. That's open. Um, <laughs> Anyways. So if it's like wonky, I'm sorry. We're sorry, guys. I'm trying to fix it. They must have a Lamborghini or yeah, something. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Oh. So this is one of the things in San Francisco that I was most excited to see. This is a quintessential part of my childhood, which was the painted ladies that are the Victorian houses from Full House. I wanted to make sure that the girls got to see this. So cool to see it what in real that? life. TGIF? Yes. Thank God it's Friday night. That was, Man, if you those, grew up in the 80s. Those were the days. Those were the days. Full House, Family Matters. Like we looked forward to Friday nights so much. It's so crazy oh to think gosh. what a different childhood our children are living. <laughs> I didn't think I really wanted to visit San Francisco, but like the movie person to me definitely does. TV, movies. So fun. Like it's just iconic for all those. I know, it's really neat. So we've arrived at the Painted Ladies and the Alamo Park that's next door is so beautiful. Such a great place to stop. There's parking all the way around the park. So there's like two hour parking spots everywhere. This is great. Good luck finding parking. <laughs> he drove around for a little bit and <laughs> dropped this off. <laughs> Man. That's what I don't like about cities is parking. It just stresses me out. Like, it's just not relaxing. You can't just bounce around. You like, you gotta have like a, like an honest to God mission plan to do yeah. anything. So Baker Beach, the first parking lot we were in, just a few trucks down from us, someone got broken into. They, all smashed their, windows their windows smashed. Like, so sad. Like in the middle of the day. I know. 
So there were afterwards there were police officers and rangers like rushing all over the place. Oh, all to over find the place. Even when we went to the other parks, like they were just rushing around. Like, too. It looks like so. it happens all the time, there everywhere. That's what everywhere. I don't like about cities. Yeah. Like you have to worry about things that you don't worry about as much in other yeah. places. There's just there's a lot of people here, and when you have a lot of people, you you uh, you increase your chances of inherently seeing bad people. Yeah. So there's crime, but. We're gonna sit back and reminisce about childhood and look at the painted ladies. <laughs> Fun. Yeah. The whole walk around this is pretty awesome. Oh yeah? Look, come film this. Film what? Watch. I'm showing the girls the, the preview. Oh. Look, watch. Can you see it? I don't know if I can see it. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Twin Peaks to get a really cool view of the city. Oh, look at the city behind us. Yeah. Turn right onto Twin Peaks Boulevard. Continue on Twin Peaks Boulevard for one mile. That is so crazy. So this is Christmas Tree Point at the top of Twin Peaks, which is a scenic drive that you can take all the way to the top to get like a panoramic view of all of San Francisco. So we've got the Golden Gate Bridge over here and the whole city on this side and the bay. It's like So we're, we're talking in here because I don't know if you can see how windy it is out there. So we're going to go out there and, and film some stuff, but I just wanted to... You won't be able to hear us talking really out there. Hear us. But we essentially just did the whole circle. So the Golden Gate Bridge is right over there. So we started our day over there and yep, then drove the all the way around. There's Alcatraz right there. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but anyways, we're way up here and we're gonna go check it out. These are the signs that are everywhere. Whole city. What are the days with vantage point? It's a, it's a pretty city. So much color in the architecture, it just makes it like so fun, especially from this view. <laughs> it's so cold that we're all back in the truck, but Daddy's still gotta try to get his last shot. Whew. Is that the end of our adventure? That is the end of the tour of San Francisco. Okay, let's go cook some dinner. Okay. I'm cold satisfied. and hungry. Layla says she feels satisfied. Yes. Everybody else? I think that was a successful trip. I agree. Yes. No, yeah. I'm not a city person. It was a good day. This is a cool city. We got a lot done. I mean, to wrap up our day with these kind of views, can't go wrong. Okay. Home, James. You must return to the wild.